and welcome back to my channel I first things first I am sweating profusely I just got out of my workout and I am back to vlog every day of the summer um, it'll be either a vlog or a sit down vlog but um, I don't know I was just feeling inspired and I want to commit to doing sort of like a um, you know how for vlogmas it's like every day which is really hard but I want to try <laughs> Today is June 9th, a Thursday that's going to be starting the series of doing everyday videos back on my channel. I want to like change a few things um, like my banner and I don't know. Um, I love this creative outlet and I can't help but create little videos wherever I find myself in, like whatever platform. I've been creating a ton of reels lately on all the activities that we have been doing, me and the kids and they're so much fun for me but there's something about a vlog you know and like sitting down that's just so much more personal and like i don't you know um anyway i am about to go home because i was just working out like crazy and i want to go rest and <sighs> i feel like i'm not sweating profusely anymore but it literally was just like so drenched just a second ago anyway we'll see what i get into I need some breakfast look at this I really like the salsa. It's dripping down, but I'm gonna clean it. Fire? How would you put a fire out? I know how. How? You jump on it, and if that doesn't work, you roll on it. Ooh. If you blow it, it gets bigger. What about that? Yeah. That would be a good idea. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, it's around 4.33. Here's Isa. I'm about to nap. So I haven't filmed a ton. I just feel like my energy is like dwindling way down. And so, yeah, I just really, really need a nap right now. I'm in a course right now. Like, knees deep. Mm, that's all about the heart and we're in the in the thick of it as far as like the dense part of it right, the, the more challenging part the part where things come up and just energetically like my energy so low but I'm so glad I went to the gym this morning there's a few things that I wanted to share with you a few different stories but I come from that side. You did come from the other side. Why does going to come from this side? Yeah. When I'm when I'm on that side, I'm on this side. That's true. Now oh, gone. this pillow is so comfortable. It's like the best thing ever. I got it on Amazon. Uh -oh. <coughs> anyway, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Say bye. Bye. I am about to go into Trader Joe's really quick. I'm drinking apple cider vinegar. Oh no, my battery's also dying. But I am going to pick up some sushi and pick up some roses. And I don't know, I just thought that I wanted that for last second. We've literally just been, um, I don't know, chilling at home. And sometimes it's nice to have those, those kind of days. As I was uh, attempting to share with you earlier that... Um, nice to just rest and receive at this moment in time there's a time for everything and yeah um yeah i'll share with you guys a little bit more a little bit later but this beautiful color out it it is so pretty it's not like the dark red you know i just think they're so beautiful and i also got some ice cream for my kids the little cones and um these chocolate little pieces and I'm ready to eat my food and my sushi, so I'm excited to go home. Let's go. Of course. Look at all this goodness of papoonis. It looks good. It looks good. Sushi. It looks so good. I'm excited. What? Oh, 
one for me and one for Isa. They're so cute. I just finished <clears throat> eating. I'm break I broke my fast around 1.30. And soon I'm going to have to go get Jace. But I thought I would have one of these. Oh, my ice cream. Thanks for my ice cream. You're welcome. My hair. I haven't changed since I went to the gym. But that's okay. We just got home. I recently upgraded my wardrobe. And I got a bunch of dresses from Express that fit really, really well. I love. And I decided to order a... What is this called? Steamer. It looks really good. So it is now the evening. It is about to be nine o'clock. My husband's taking a real estate class, and Isa sleeping. He was like taking a nap, and now I don't know if that's going to turn into like an all-night thing or not. Jace is playing games, but anyway, I um, never took a shower, <laughs> um, so I'm going to do that soon. But um, I was testing out the steamer right now. I'm waiting for it to heat up that I got on Amazon, which I'm really excited about, especially like I was sharing with you guys for that whole new wardrobe upgrade that I um, got myself. Uh, it was long overdue. It's been a really long time um, since I bought things that, um, I don't know, since I went like shopping, like really shopping and concentrating on things that feel flattering, not just like, okay, yeah, I guess I'll pick this up because... I need more clothes to wear or you know whatever the reason it was more like with intention it had been a really long time um, also I don't know if I mentioned but as you guys can see I changed my hair which I really like for now for the summer and just to express myself creatively for something that matches my new energy you know sometimes we crave that change um, but yeah anyway I wanted to share with you guys that tomorrow I have an appointment at 9 a.m. Well, um, what is it called? Communion uh, meeting with one of my teachers. I am in one of her courses and it's all about the heart, heart expansion. And it's <sighs> been a little bit intense here at the beginning. So I love that I'm getting that extra support for the things that have been coming up for me. But it's all really, really, really cool stuff. And... I also signed up for a pottery class. It's an intro class. I saw that they have a package like for the whole month of July, but I just signed up for tomorrow. I was going to and then some things happened and I see everything as a sign and I also check in with my spirit guides and angels and so anyway, I ended up just signing up for the class tomorrow, which I'm so excited about because I don't know if you've been following me on Instagram or if you know this about me, but there is something about pottery, there is something about it that makes me really, really excited and um, blissed out, uh, just admiring the art of it. I think it's the art. Um, I've been going a lot to this rare coin shop because my kid's really, really into coins and silver and gold and that whole thing. And I noticed that the owner, like the reason why he's so passionate about it and loves it so much is because of the art because of the handcrafting um that's involved and i totally get that i can see that in different places you know um like dexterity working with your hands and all of that is just really cool to me so long story short i've only done pottery once uh, when i was a kid in puebla mexico and it was i made like a little jar thing but anyway so i'm so excited that class is gonna be at 5 p.m tomorrow just gonna go with his dad i'm also working out in the morning um and yeah i have more things planned coming up i really want to <laughs> vlog daily but um things come up where like i feel like things are boring you know and so i don't film and i don't know just the whole thing but um, yeah i don't know i like to document my like this is my art handcrafting um, videos so and sharing and um, that outflow of things that I learn and that I want to share with everyone you know hopefully um, it does make an impact or change somebody's day in, in a thing or two you know that I say 
Um, yeah, so there's that. What else did I want to share with you guys? That's been coming up. Um, I've just been really laying low over these last couple of weeks. I haven't even been posting on Instagram that much as far as um, channeled content, um, if you know what I mean. Um, it's more like just living my life, lifestyle, I guess. Um, but of course, I'm here to share, you know, deeper wisdom and... I've just sort of been like, you know what, right now it's time to rest, which I keep hearing all of my teachers talk about that anyway, that at this time um, we're all just sort of resting for this next thing that is coming that we don't know what it is yet, but um, yeah, just taking it easy, especially with all of the changes and all of the transformation and all of that, that collectively we've been experiencing it, but also... Uh, just on a personal note so yeah okay anyway. i filled it with water to the line it's really warm so i don't know um what to do next it says to unplug it like well anyway nothing's coming out yet it's hot though i don't know if you can see but um it did start to steam oh my gosh that was silly it is steaming a little bit so um yeah, it's portable. I don't know. It'll be nice for travel. Hello, everybody. It is Saturday morning, June 11th. I am going to journal, so I have my little notebook. I decided that from now on, my journaling notebooks are going to be like these big <laughs> notebooks. And in fact, this one's skinny for like what I want because there's so much to write. Um, I'm going to do my meditation. I am to meditate daily for about 15 minutes or so um, with that week's meditation that I um, my teacher gives me for the course that I'm in involving the heart it's called the new human and it's really more than just a course right um, yeah <laughs> um, but anyway yeah my little meditation things come up so I'm going to journal and I literally just woke up, so that's why I look like this. Everyone in my family is still sleeping. I um, did sign up for the gym like I was sharing with you guys this morning. So I'm going to do that, journal, and get started with my day. And that's it. I'm wearing a braid, but the majority of my hair like pops out. Because it's in layers. been drinking black coffee uh, for a good little while now and it's totally fine I am going to be a minute late I just put the directions so I gotta get started um, but anyway oh, I shifted this class is hard <laughs> here I am I'm out of the class you guys that's really hard I recorded a lot of things um, vertical for uh, real but I'll insert them here so you guys can see We'll see how that turned out because it was hard and <laughs> it was crazy but I feel amazing as always so so worth it got so many compliments on my leggings and on to the next thing I gotta draw go drop Jace eat <laughs> Jace JC my son all that is dad's um, and get ready for my noon I am obsessed. I'm going there. All right. Um, if you'll need the restroom is right here. Thank you. Cut the wheel off. It's very hard to catch the play. But you have to do one or the other. You need to catch your cut the wheel off. If you 
you need or eventually that's going to come back and it's going to hit this water bucket, it's going to go up in the air and we're all going to get wet and it's a major bummer. Alright? The thing is, it's the easiest thing on the planet to afford. So, um, I want you guys to all put your on about half speed. So just push it down about halfway and then put your foot on the ground. Perfect. I want you Perfect. If you miss the center, uh, see how easy it is to move the wheel? Before I ask the same questions over over, is anybody got a problem if I touch their hands? No. Did I already ask that? No. No? Okay. So, let me pedal up a little bit faster. Really, really good. It is going to be a little bit tougher, I think, with the, the nails. And a little bit slower next time. That's it we see, right? But what I want you to think is when you start, I want you to commit. We're moving on to the next thing. Um, so as long as you didn't get like just got out of my pottery class. I have clay all over. That was so fun. Uh, I loved it. I don't even know how long we've been there. An hour and 45 minutes. Pretty insane. We were having so much fun. Um, I kind of wanted to go to the mall after here, so I still might. But I am covered in clay. Um, had so much fun. I picked out, I made two pieces and I bought them. I'm going to come back and glaze them and it's going to be awesome. I saw him at the mall. I got two bras at Soma. I got a bathing suit at Airy. I'm just waiting on a pizza for Mr. Isa there. And I. And I also got a charm at Reed's, which I will have to do the unboxing when we get home. But it's a crown and it says Queen. And it goes perfect with the healing that I did today with Miss Lila, which I'll tell you guys about it too. Good morning. I need a shower. I need to make breakfast. It's actually pretty late. It's almost lunchtime. And anyway, we're all still just in pajamas in my house. I'm about to start drinking coffee and waking up. But I wanted to show you what I got at Reed's, which was really from Pandora um, inside of Reed's. And it's a little charm. But the reason why I got that charm, as I was sharing with you guys, I had a session with Lila, the multidimensional mother, on Instagram and here on YouTube. I am in her Starburst community, which is a Patreon community where she does meditations and Q&As and she just shares stuff from her guides and just different things throughout the month. Love her. Um, I hope to meet her in person soon, but it already feels like I have it's just really interesting with people that you're so aligned with that soul recognition is just like it feels like i've known her excuse me for forever and like we have met in person anyway i'm also in her new human course which is not really a course like i said it's much deeper than that i think i did share that um it's not intellectual stuff that you would learn per se it's more like transmissions and activations and deep remembrance and just the enfoldment of my own journey and my own heart um with all of that said i had a session for things that were coming up for me and about two years ago um in astral travel journeys that i've had i have seen myself on a journey for a long time like on a carriage like on a journey i just see, saw that for a long time and then i finally arrived at a castle um and it turns out that that castle is my heart but i was hanging out on the steps for a long time and so yeah i finally went inside of my castle and i'm learning much more um in deep layers about my heart and the way that um it works and what's in, what's 
inside but anyway this session felt like a coronation there was a lot of healing of past life stuff um and that's about as much as i want to share about that so yeah um i think i don't know if i've talked about like peasant consciousness or not but this has been a theme in my life so knowing that i am a queen but still like my embodiment was not matching that right so i wanted like to see or like figure out oh i was like what is that what is going on um so anyway this was like finally a coronation of i am queen um which you know symbolizes sovereignty and just that inner power and higher perspective so without further ado my charm oh and i have my pandora bracelet has a castle that i got a while back and so okay so first of all it felt really um special that he Hold on. the guy who i got this from or that was helping me oops sorry package with it with so much care love and attention so he put my receipt in here which just feels really nice you know um let's see. yeah my receipt's in there and then he gave me a little reads box cute I can't wait to put it on my bracelet oh this makes my heart so happy let me see if it'll focus because it was not focusing but it is a crown and underneath it says queen so yeah oh, I love it so much okay you will I also got this cute little purse because the one that I have is already not looking um, its best. And it's actually really nice. Out of all the purses that they had, different brands, this one from Aldo um, looks the nicest. And we also got a detangler brush. Just because since I colored my hair, I am just being really careful with it and whatnot. So this is just, you know, two soaps. And also these wine glasses because they're so cute and we don't have any we broke all the ones we had we actually don't have a lot of kitchen stuff since we got married <laughs> what was it six years ago now and anyway, 